obviously migration is the only option. Ladies and gentlemen, a, the Islamic State has made Yazidi women into flesh to be trafficking, trafficked in. I very much hope that humanity has not yet disappeared. Firstly, uh, more, more than 3,400 women and children still need to be released. They are still suffering. Secondly, that's the first thing. Secondly, the facts need to be established. There were murders, uh, collective slavery, and uh, that needs to be qualified as genocide. I hope that you can convey this the case of genocide to the International Court. Please do this. Thirdly, please liberate all of our territory today so that we can bury our dead, so that we can have a protected area for Yazidis and threatened minorities so that one day we can live again in our region in peace. I would ask for a national budget, to, a national budget rather, to be established to compensate victims and to enable them to rebuild their region. Please open your societies to us. We have been the victim of genocide and we need countries that respect our dignities. Identity. Every day, hundreds and thousands of people are risking their lives. We do hope that you will give us the possibility, as Yadizi and other minorities, as Germany has done, to come and live in your countries. Finally, I uh, implore you, get rid of Daesh completely. I went through this terrible suffering because of them. I've seen what they've done to boys and girls. All those who commit the crime of trafficking and genocide need to be brought to justice so that women and children can live in peace in Syria, Iraq, Somalia, and Nigeria, everywhere.